628 lawmakers from 32 countries and across party lines have issued a joint statement calling on the Chinese Communist Party CCP, to immediately stop the systemic and brutal campaign to eradicate the spiritual discipline of Falun Gong. The persecution of Falun Gong in China has been one of the harshest campaigns against a faith group in modern times, says the joint statement. We urge the Chinese government to respect international norms and to immediately stop the persecution of Falun Gong in China and to unconditionally release all detained Falun Gong practitioners and other prisoners of conscience. The joint statement is an unprecedented effort by parliamentarians who hail from across the political spectrum to condemn injustices committed by the CCP against Falun Gong. The joint international statement notes that Falun Gong is an ancient Chinese meditation practice based on the three principles of truthfulness, compassion, and tolerance. It is beneficial for both physical health and moral improvement. But then leader of the Chinese Communist Party, Jiang Zemin, was afraid of Falun Gong which had hundreds of millions of practitioners. Since July 1999, millions of Falun Gong practitioners in China have been arbitrarily arrested and jailed without due process, and many have been tortured and even killed. Under the initiative of Peter Kent and Judy Skuro, the co-chairs of Friends of Falun Gong in the Canadian Parliament, more than 60 federal members co-signed the joint statement. The Joint International Statement notes past resolutions from the European Parliament, United Nations, human rights organizations, and U.S. Congress condemning the persecution of Falun Gong, while referencing a 2019 independent tribunal in the United Kingdom that found that forced organ harvesting has been committed for years throughout China on a significant scale, and that Falun Gong practitioners have been one and probably the main source of organ supply.